pop-up hobby shop, your traveling one-stop shop specializing in collector's items, Pokemon cards, musical instruments, sports memorabilia, and much more. Look up Pop-Up Hobby Shop on Facebook and look out for our booth popping up near you. Delta! Woo! 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 And we're back. Couple weeks off. Everything got all fucked up, but we're back. It's episode 42, Relentless with the Fellas. As always, brought to you by our friends at Tony's Joint. Tony's Three Joint. convenient locations, Essex, Kingsville, Leamington. You can go in there for literally anything. Pre-rolls. Uh, literally everything, fucking drinks, edibles, flour, whatever you want. Do what you do we, what do we always say? Go in the Tony's. All your dope needs. For all your dope all needs. Your dope but it also brought needs. up a thought in my head. Are yeah. stores selling like mushrooms? I don't think they're there yet. Not quite. But I can, I think it's coming. Because the, 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 the delivery service that I've been using for a bit sometimes, <laughs> they are now selling mushrooms. Government oh, mushrooms are It's, it's, it's a, the gray yeah. area delivery service. But. <laughs> so on that there note. There is mushroom stores and shit right now, too, like in places. On that like, note. But anyways, yeah, it's called Tony's. the grocery store. So <laughs> I'll give you guys a pick of which one you guys want. You, Just fire that there's shit There's Rocket, yeah, Icicle, or Pete. No, I'm going to give you guys one oh. each. Oh, okay. Okay, what is it? Rocket, Icicle. Or peach punch, or we have wavy watermelon, strawberry slurricane, and lemonade, pink lemonade. I want pink lemonade. Man, I'll take the icicle one. Yeah. So what's up, bitch? Pink okay, so. lemonade does sound good, though. Yeah. You're also, also just so you're aware, ones, some of those fruity ones to me are like the peach. It's a little too uh, peachy. Peach, that's me. I'm not too much. Even for drinks and stuff like watermelon and peach and yeah, stuff, it's just yeah. too much. Like, yeah. It's infused. Ooh, oh just so you're I'm aware, really it is still Listen, illegal to digging. sell. When we start suicide. hacking our brains out. Let's <laughs> yeah. try not to cough directly into the mic. Yeah, you're going to fuck it. It's yeah. still illegal yeah. to sell mushrooms in Canada, just so you know. It's illegal? Yes. Says who? The government. Cam, do you, want, do you want one of these, or are you good with the home I'm good with the over home. there? Mm. Really nice. All right. Can I have a letter? Man. But anyways, yeah. I'm going to go with the strawberry slurricane. Without even lighting it, it tastes like, like, Saint, this, like a gummy in my mouth, like... If God had a dick, <laughs> if God had a dick and place it on your tongue, this is what well, it like, would be. Uh, to be to be all unfair, like it is a <laughs> tiny, tiny joint. It's a Charlie Dick. Huh. <laughs> Come on, it's like a Come Charlie. On. It looks, in the middle it's of a Charlie one. Dick. Come on, it's now. little and it looks like it's rolled in dirt. <laughs> 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 that was only one time It was cold And we were on a baseball diamond What do you expect? <laughs> you guys are fucked up but, uh, Yeah So, so anyways Light them up boys Let's see I need a lighter Sorry, I'm, I'm not a fuck here I'm not a fucking I'm trying to be a courteous podcast hoster Hits the camera Ooh. Hits me in the nads Me and camera have to she's drop she's packed him. tight Because there's no suction <laughs> Um, if anybody knows suction, and it's I can fucking yeah. suck it hard. You know what I'm saying? I can yeah. suck it hard. Oh yeah. So, uh, so, anyways, now that we're so, what's up, guys? It's been only been fucking a month. No shit. Fucking Charlie. Well, sometimes people. Oh me, <laughs> me. Everything gets sorry, blamed I have on a Charlie. Kid. Well, sorry, wrestling. Well, let's was talk on. about pay per view wrestlings that you could just watch the next day because no one's talking about AEW, so it's not like it's gonna be spoiled. You can literally go home and watch it. Tell I, I oh, got here one we question. go. Here hey, we go. Give me one reason why I should. Here's our here. here's our TikTok clip. I will kick the fuck out of you. It was Sting's final match. So no, eat a I fat get it. I, hey, and I didn't say anything about it. Yeah, you did. No, I you just now did. I did. But I didn't say anything about not recording that night. I was fine with not recording. Like I know you, the, your pay per views are important to you. Okay. So yeah, yeah, no. So fuck you. It's Sting's final match. I'm not. No, gonna, I like I said when. <laughs> <laughs> when all it was going on, no, time. I didn't say anything. But then all of a sudden, you're like, "It's my fault that we didn't record." Ooh, 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 I gotta blame ooh, it on you, bitch. Yeah, so. that's why you're. I've been sitting out on my tired. ass for the last four days. Mm-hmm. Not me. I'm just lazy. But I wanted to bring it because you know, we always say back every time, and sometimes we don't have our man Cam behind the yeah. ones and twos, as they call it, and we almost lost him again tonight. Yeah, Cam, fill us in real quick <laughs> before uh, we get rolling here. All right, so don't I yell. was glad like, to have you, by the way. Always hey, your microphone's you. turned up, so don't yell. Make oh, sure it's yeah, on shit. first, eh? Yeah, I'll yeah. back up. That's good. That's good one. Is so, it on? Um, I was out skating, you know, having a little rip around the park there, trying to get my legs ready because me and Charlie are trying to work on a six skate video, hopefully. Yeah. 
Oh, yeah. Um, playing in big things. Yes. It's going to be a good time. That sounds good. Um, so Might I was ripping break. around, and then all of a sudden I got a text from Erica, and then she was like, so remember how I was having these problems? And I was like, yeah. And then uh, she's like, well, my mom called an ambulance to check my vitals and all this fun stuff. So she ended up taking that ride with the ambulance because they told her, hey, you should just go in and just get checked out and stuff like that. Nothing serious. Everything just did they, minor. Did they give right? her a pregnancy test? Uh, just, no, she's been taking pregnancy I just tests. Bust, I just say to everybody, as soon as anybody oh. gets sick at all, I go, she's pregnant. So, <laughs> yeah. but, but his, his reply was, she's been taking pregnancy tests, so you know they've been going oh, hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, we always go. But okay. the funny, the, what I was going to say from the first thing, he was like, hey, you know what I've been having Jedi. those problems? It's like, yeah. uh... You gotta be a bit more specific than right? that. <laughs> you well, know? We, well, I'm trying not yeah, to get so specific. Women and yeah, yeah, problems. Yeah. She's, she's okay though. Right? But she's yeah, yeah. she's all good. Yeah. yeah. She just, she just ended up taking the ambulance ride to the hospital, hanging out. Basically, she got blood work, all that stuff. We're just waiting yeah. results as of now, still. Yeah. Um. But uh, yeah, she. So she's pretty, she pretty much was texting me. Of, obviously, like I'm texting her left and right. Like we've been in touch the whole time because I like you know obviously. Erica, I yeah. we asked him why the fuck he was here. Yeah. Chelsea's not. Don't her, don't, right? hey, don't blame Nana. us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, so yeah. Chelsea was right. gonna go to Nana so that way we could hang out and all that fun stuff. But I'm texting Erica, and I'm like, you know, just trying to make her laugh because she's there by herself and shit. Uh, of course. So I was like, it's okay. You probably, uh, I was like, you probably got some people in there with, uh, you know, minor little issues, need some Tylenol, which they could just go to shoppers for and shit like that. And then she said, laughing my ass off, like, bold capital. And she's like, a kid next to me has a cut from a butter knife, legitimately. Oof. And another kid who was jumped by a transgender. Mm. And I started laughing. I was like, there's oh, no fucking wow. way you got that. And you I went to like, the hospital. You got jumped? Yeah. So I wonder what he said. <laughs> oh, you said something. He said some shit. <laughs> well, he went, first, gotta well, remember. <laughs> they the still have thing, that strength. The first, the first thing I said to Cam... Uh, I said, was it one of those like, oh, I'm not really sure. I, I Maybe I should just go to the hospital because, you know, girls do tend to s- kind of lean that way sometimes where guys will, you know, they'll have a numb arm and be like, man, my arm's numb. And then it's like, keep going back to what they're doing. It's like you're working yeah. and you're like, fuck, yeah. you lift it. You're like, this, yeah. like yeah. yeah. To me, it's like the last option good. sometimes is like, OK, is this happening? Yeah. Is this happening? OK, maybe I should go to the hospital. But like avoid the hospital at all costs. There is one time at work I was carrying, I was putting in a door and with, with tempered glass, the, the corners are the, the weak spots. So if you hit the corner off of poof. the tile or something, the whole thing will poof, but it, it goes into these tiny fucking, you know, everyone's seen broken glass yeah. before that's tiny and that's safe. So it's safety glass. So it doesn't slice your fucking arm and, and cut your, you know, your, your tendons and shit, but you can get cut. When it falls on you, right? So right away, I notice this cut on my arm, and it's bleeding pretty good. So I just cover it up right away, and I'm like, oh, shit, we got to go. Like, we got to go to the hospital, man. We get to the hospital, and I'm waiting and waiting, holding it, not looking at it the whole time, kind of, like, worried on the way because it's close to, you know, main vein type shit on my forearm. Uh, the lady, like, lifts the thing, and it's the littlest fucking <laughs> cut that we all start laughing. <laughs> and and so they were like, okay, well, you know, sit and wait. And as soon as we sat and wait, I just got up and left and was just like, I don't even need to fucking be Let's here. Let's go this back to like, work. But, He's too yeah. scared to look oh, at it. Oh, dude, it was fucking, yeah, I definitely. But it was one, like, I didn't even look at it. It, bl- it bled a lot. Even my dad had to go back and, like, clean up and clean up the blood. And it was... uh. And there was another time. It's probably because he had a few beers. Because yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he was hammered the night before. His blood was work, still. Before lunch. But. And there was <laughs> another time lunch. me and Seth were on a job. And he was putting in a mirror in this small kind of thing. Uh, and it was wall to wall. So it was kind of wedged in there because it was too tight. And he had his hand inside it. And he pulled. And sure enough, the thing cracked right in his hand and fell. And he sliced his hand real good. And he started bleeding everywhere. And he's like, I got to go. And I, and I stayed and cleaned behind and everything. He ended up having a, having a good ne- fucking slice on his hand. Class business, but, buddy. Uh, oh, yeah, man. I seen it's some fucking, shit. Today, we had to put in this giant fucking mirror that you have to lift up to, like, vanity height, which is, you know, mm-hmm. over waist height. This thing's, like, 110 high. Flimsy as shit. 
And it's just like, man, people, these customers want this bullshit, and it just reflects your dumb whiteness on your ceiling, and you're putting my life in danger almost. But yeah, I'm getting paid fucking 28 bucks an hour to yeah. do this shit. Yeah. But hey, it's the job. We all done bullshit <laughs> hey, work, it's right? a job. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we all done bullshit work. No, but yeah, avoid God. the fucking hospital. I don't miss glass. I don't miss glass. Going to the hospital because I got jumped by a transgender. I might have the AIDS. I got jumped by a transgender. <laughs> Can I tell you guys a fucking absolute horror story? What, That's is it about the transgender? No, about the, the oh. thing out here, the pipe. Oh, the pipe, oh, the shit pipe. Bro, okay. Your so, house? Or so your, listen or to this sewer. shit. Listen to this shit, the sewer pipe. So probably a few months ago, we had a big-ass clog here, right? So we had a, I had a place come in. They took care of it or whatever. Snaked it up? Yeah, snaked it up. So then all done or whatever. So now they start to build this thing across the street from my house the house mm. it's a duplex i think but they say there's four of them in there i don't know i only see two garage doors and shit so i'm confused but anyways i noticed the porta john today yeah, and that's yeah. a, a, a tell, telltale sign yeah. that it's so when they were locating the <laughs> <laughs> I'm so like, so glad we got that on camera that but, went in my mouth. <laughs> um so when they were locating the sewer lines to, sorry to make it kind of confusing, but to go back when they were here the first time when they snaked, we were looking for this sewer line because we wanted to snake that too. So we couldn't find it. So anyways, they build this across the street or whatever. Then they fucking come here. Well, the guy who locates the sewer lines came fucking into my yard unannounced while we were gone to work and shit. Dug up part of the fucking sewer pipe. Broke off the fucking end of the check thing. Yeah. Right, I didn't even know it was there. I was looking for it. Yeah, and then um, or whatever. Then they left. Well, by the time we noticed it, fucking rocks and shit have got in there. Well, the pipe fucking broke. So like, I'm calling all these companies that I know that have worked across the street, and they're all just fucking pointing fingers at each around. other. So I'm like, well, I have to have this fixed. Like my house is down to one shitter. There's five of us. It's down to two shitters. It's got two shitters now. Yeah. <laughs> Just stopped. Hang on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is so I know boring. exactly where I'm. Two, three. Okay, so, so anyway, so the guy fucking breaks off the pipe. The pipe clogs, breaks. So I'm calling all these fucking companies. I'm like, who the fuck came in my yard unannounced? Okay, so the part that pissed me off the most about it was, and I told the one guy. Who's black? No, you're fucking <laughs> no. Anyways, fucking oh, we're canceled. Dumbass, yeah. So anyways, That's I'm fucking calling all these folks. guys. All they're doing is pointing fucking fingers at fucking one another. But so I went to the guy who's in charge of the fucking job site. And I'm like, listen, motherfucker, you're in charge here. What company this is, is your. I'm uh, not going to say. Yeah, we don't I'm not going to say. I'm be, I, and I'm being a nice guy by doing I that, only by ask the way. for my it? interest of being in the trade. So listen. Stuff, so. So I fucking, so I tell him, I'm like, you're in charge of this shit. You're the fucking top guy. So I'm no coming to you like, this is fucking stupid. <laughs> no, but it's stupid. You shut the fuck up for well, a second. Sorry, so anyways, like, fuck face. So they fucking come here the first time to do the scope or, or the fucking, the like camera thing. Yeah. Cost me $260. You had to pay? Listen, yes. Fuck man, these I'm guys are asking so questions. Okay, we're so, it's a podcast. We have. A anyways, the next fucking time, so they see that the pipe was also split. So not only did he fucking break the cap of it when he dug to fucking find the line, he hit it with his fucking shovel. It's a perfect fucking length, dude. Jeez. So then I'm like, that shit. I'm like, it couldn't have been me. I didn't even know it was there. Yeah. To have that pipe, everything fixed, everything total, done, fucking cameras, dug up, replaced, fixed, everything. I'm now $800 into this. And they're not helping? No. Nope. So no what's the company is. name? I'm not going to yeah. Tell me the name. Yeah. Yeah. I'll, Just I'll say tell it. you off there. They're I'm not, not helping gonna... you, so who gives no, a fuck? No, but it's still. No, because sh- everybody's still like chatting well, about it. And the so worst thing why... about that is, is they got to... The Usually only reason why like I paid for it, yes. that comes but the only reason why I it. fucking paid for it is because it has to be fixed. I can't yeah, yeah, oh yeah. have my house on one yeah, toilet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I can, once we figure this shit out, I can say to somebody, well, here's your fucking yeah. bill. Yeah, reimbursement type shit. Yeah. Okay. So, hey, just know whoever you are. But 
we're coming for you. I mean, but still, it's fucking, you know what I mean? I shouldn't have to go through all this shit. fucking 1800 bucks. And you want to know the fuck though. Yeah. But oh, yeah, you want to totally, know what man. I think it, it it was? I think somebody from the town had to come here and locate that fucking yeah, sewer pipe a, yeah. to tell them. So that's who I'm thinking it is. I've talked to all these companies too, the ones that I have noticed have been working over there so yeah you just might saying. have to talk to your like even town council or something to say, eight hey, like, fucking hundred dollars into this shit dude yeah, so yeah. the next question i wanted to ask you That's guys is not a bad price just no just but saying. the guy I the reason gonna be way more no the reason being be. between that shitter upstairs when it clogged to that one out there everything i'm like eighteen hundred dollars in on toilets here mm. so but my old that's house, the big one of the biggest necessities. My old yeah. house had a bag. so everything should be crispy rice in this house right now. So when I bought my old house, <laughs> you know it, it was uh, fuck. I wish I could remember the year. Long, uh, oh, Nineteen eighty one. No. But what I wanted to <laughs> ask you guys though was, what was but, the worst plumbing disaster? Well, this you guys yeah, this all? is where I'm getting at, kind oh, of. Yeah. So when I bought the house, uh, uh, f- a. F- they say, you know, you can get an inspector and blah, 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 and this and that, and it costs money. Well, you, you guys remember Dan Dabrowski, who played baseball with yeah. our dads, Big, Big Dan. Dan. Is that the guy that would throw you down and fart on you? Oh, yeah. man. That's <laughs> the loudest guy in the room, biggest guy in the room. But uh, like he came through and checked the house, and, like, you know, he, and he said, you, and, like, everything was galvanized. Most of it was galvanized. But the plumbing wasn't too uh, code. <laughs> no, it wasn't too in, in, in intricate. Okay. So to change it all was pretty easily, but like the sewage is the big thing, right? Like that's your galvanized, right? So anyways, years down the line, there was there was multiple times where uh the upstairs cuz I had an upstairs toilet which was on uh, the second floor and then I had a basement toilet which is directly under it, right? So the basement toilet was one day started fucking clogging and backing up, right? Well, I would have, like, when I, I didn't know nothing about it, so I kind of just cleaned it and, like, put some tape over the lid and cl- taped the lid down saying, like, don't don't use, right? Yeah. And left it, and then, you know, I had a party, and someone had cut it and opened it and, like, pissed in it. Oh. And, like, you go down a couple days later, and you're like, oh, my God, and it smells like the worst shit you've ever smelled ever. And then, yeah. all of a sudden, from flushing upstairs it was causing more just, and more to come up through the downstairs oh, toilet. No. So I went down one day and I had a sub pump that like the basement wasn't like finished. Like not like it didn't have nice flooring. Yeah. It was, it was a jam basement, like grungy type shit. So it would literally go right into the sub pump and get pumped out. But I'm like, I got to fix this shit. Right. So I bring <laughs> another buddy from baseball. Will yeah. bro, the really bro, you know, yeah. and we take the toilet off. We try and plug it all. And, you know, it just still coming up. So I had to call this and that get it snaked. The city guy came out and, and there's rules on like where they can snake as far as if you're like if you're plumbing or if there's an access close enough to the wall that's close enough to the edge of your property, they're allowed to snake it. But if it's any further, you got to call like a plumber and pay for it to happen and shit. So he's like, I can only snake like up to here legally kind of, and I'll help you out and blah, blah, blah. So then I luckily called this guy on the internet who ended up showing (laughs) up and he was a hockey buddy and he fucking snaked it for me. He was like, you're good to go. But I had to carry that old toilet out. It was it was literally like it was, it was fucking <laughs> chunks of like toilet paper and paper towel soaked in shit and water. <laughs> that uh, yeah, and it, it, you know it was splashing. It was fucked. Splashing yeah, on you, yeah. hitting your lips like a and, Bentley. And I'm a gagger. I like when it comes Bentley to smells. Thing. I'm a gagger when it comes to smells and shit like that. So it was. Uh, you get a yeah. poop mustache, yeah. your lips accidentally yeah. hit against yeah. the thing and gives you a poop stash. Then I sold that house <laughs> and said, I'll see you later. Nice. <laughs> and then they ended up reselling it for like a lot more yeah. a year later. It's always what happens. Yeah. Someone, you know. Yeah. So if you would have just hung out for a year. But you I can't, don't even think it was listen, that. Listen, you can't. I listen, couldn't anymore. I say to Katie all the time, too, is like, you can't live your life like that, dog. You can't live like in hindsight. Like, oh, yeah. I should have did it. Fuck that, dog. Gives a fuck. Mm-hmm. Can't mm-hmm. live like that. Don't live like that, y'all. Don't do that. No, no, no. It's not worth it. No, man. Like people look like, like dwell on shit, lose sleep over, like, oh fuck. Who gives fuck? So many cares? things in your life can influence you to think so 
like too fast, right? You know, yeah. you watch a movie about a guy dying of cancer, and you're like, oh, I need to live my life, which is true. You yeah. need to live your life like it's, it may be your last day. But then you also, you know, go through something like yeah. that, and you know, oh, shit. Kate, Katie fucking Katie hates it because she worries about everything, and I'm just yeah, it's hard it. not to. Fuck. It's, fuck it. It like, is hard not to. I mean, we I, when I smoke weed, I don't. For but. me, I just <laughs> I'm just like <laughs> if it's, so it's not I've right. always been if it's be out of my control. I've never, sp- I don't, whatever. It is what yeah, it is. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. Like, yeah. You know what I mean? It'll work out. It always, listen, it always works out. It always yeah. does. Yeah. One way or another, it always works out. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, you know. Think about it. You really, you really start to think and, you know. It's like, they put the weed down, motherfucker. Yeah. No, no but, but for real, though. I mean, you, you hate to think bushes. about the less fortunate, but a lot of people got it a <laughs> lot, lot worse. That's in true. a lot of fucking ways. That's true. I'm not know? giving hand no jobs behind the Wendy's dumpster. No matter how fucking hard dumpster. your day it seems to be because you're late for work and Jesus. fucking, you know, your coffee got spilt on you or yeah. whatever it may be. Which is, e- like I said, it's easy to get so fucking influenced and, and think in the moment that, like, your shit matters so yeah. fucking much, right? Yeah. People, yeah. Yeah. Oh, and we all do. Everyone does it, right? Yeah. Like, it's my world. Y'all yeah. motherfuckers yeah. are living in it. Luke fu- Luke smashed a fucking TV over Fortnite. What? Did you? So what'd you do? Did you punch I, him he in the wasn't face? with me. He was at his mom's <laughs> house, and Did I just get a text. And like I'm, ha- I'm watching this fucking movie, having a blast, and like, cause to me, doing an action like that makes me think. Like some, I did something fucking wrong. Where you're punching, you think in any way that fucking punching a TV you gotta, but, is any but type you gotta, of idea. You got to think about this though, okay? Is how many times have you played a game and you just couldn't beat it, or something happened? And you're like, fuck. Oh yeah. You know what I mean? And I'm okay with but that. But he's he's young. Like he he you know. Well, even when I was young, I smashed a Game Boy off my but knee. The problem and is, I get it. You uh, you punch your punch a TV when we were kids. Those tube TVs. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Next you know, thing you know, so you take my good hand. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. Strong hand. Maybe that's why we don't punch TVs because we grew up thinking like you'd be. Done. We had to but, punch no, the his Zenith. Mom, his mom texts me and said, "So he just punched his TV and now he's bawling." And you know, I mean, my first reaction was to go off the handle. Like, what do you like? What did you think was going? And I don't know. I don't know so know, is it wrecked? Oh yeah. Fuck. How big is it? It's probably same kind of size. You want one? I mean. There's one that's my... not that's not the point, you know. I'll take one. Yeah. <laughs> so TV, hey, but one... that ain't teaching him nothing, you there, know what I mean? There's one in my, my basement. My thing was like, man, I didn't raise you. Yeah. And when I do, I'll be in the other room and I can hear it. I'm like, man, first of all, Fortnite ain't fucking easy. You ain't gonna win every time. No, you're gonna it, get it's your impossible. Ass whipped. Every time he loses, he's like, they're fucking cheating. Oh, fucking but like I swear night. too much, but he does swear sometimes too. And I'm just like, man. I used to tell Hunter. It's a video game. I used to tell Hunter all the time. Gosh. He'd say the same thing. You're hacking. I'd be like, no, dude, you oh, suck. Yeah. Problem is, is you're not good at the game. Yeah. You're I fucking said, oh, five it's years old. Or every like, time you get you killed, suck. every time you get killed, it's because <laughs> yeah. someone's cheating or you cheeks. messed up. It's like you don't just accept that. Sometimes you lose. Like, your cheeks. And I'm cool with oh, all. <laughs> when I, when I'm playing lot. Fortnite and I lose, I'm like, ah, oh, <laughs> fuck. Like I'm okay with something like that. Or like, God dang! It's like me when but I hit the post in NHL. Smashing, yeah, like smashing Fuck. your TV. Yeah, it's what crazy. Do you, it's crazy. What do you yeah. think's gonna happen, yeah. right? And you know, now you're here crying and sobbing all night. But I still have to punish you. And I was looking forward because I didn't have them the first half of March break. Yeah, and I got so, them yeah. tomorrow. And the rest of yeah. it, I was looking forward to playing some Fortnite with yeah. them. But now I can't let them play Fortnite. Yeah, no, for at least no. a couple days. Play so it's like. Else. Do something else. Fuck, man. It's going to be yeah. nice out. Have you ever smashed like a... Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Not a TV or nothing like that. You know, we, we used to... <laughs> yeah, yeah, we yeah. used to go through Sony oh, paddles yeah. like they were fucking... Yeah. Fucking... But it's like one of those things is I'm buying them, though. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. And like you smash it, you're like... Fuck. Yeah, no, as soon as you like do... there's you, 80 bucks. <laughs> you do it, I and you're like, like... And then you sit there, and you're like, I don't care. I don't care. Whatever. Whatever. And then fucking 10 minutes later, you're just sitting there, and you're like... Yeah. Oh, you feel like an idiot. asshole because you're like, now I'm a fucking. Now loser I gotta use this one that the fucking yeah, dog yeah. chewed the control. Yeah. I gotta thing. use this one. And all I do is skate <laughs> into the boards with it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, and both of his controllers are fucked up too. Because what's he got? He has a PlayStation, but I'm sure he fucking. Yeah. You know, you know, I know how it is, but. Yeah. Um. You I know, once you do it, you feel paddle. you feel shame. You go to the box, you feel shame. Yeah. <laughs> he's, he's a bond. But I want like I haven't got a chance to ask him like, are are you crying because you can't play Fortnite now and you're grounded, or are you crying because you feel like you did something actually wrong and you're sorry? Because like, 
Yeah. You know, there's two different kind of scenarios there. Yeah. And so we'll Just see. Tell him, or you have to take a stone cold stunner right yeah, now. Yeah, and yeah, that's yeah. the only yeah. way you get out of it. No. And that's and you know, like the kick March everything. Break, right. So it's like, that doesn't really, you know, make yeah. it easy to have a good rest of March break. So yeah. we'll see. Yeah. I got him tomorrow, which I mean, you guys, by what? the time you're listening to this, guess it's what? Like in the future. Guess what? At least you still have a TV at your house. Yeah, I do. <laughs> it's like, do I let, like? I can't just let him sit there and play Fortnite on it, no. or like even you know. Yeah, you do. So what are you I gonna do? With Roblox. Say no. So, so you're not allowed to play do? Fortnite, but then you put Fortnite videos. No, on No, he YouTube. ain't playing his Oculus. He has an ah. Oculus too, and it's like, what am I gonna buy you a new controller because you threw it on the ground yeah. and it smashed? So yeah. you gotta at least realize and prove to me that you can play without getting crazily right. attached and. Right. Taking it too serious, or just say it's a game, dude. Yeah, it's, and I have a and lot of times. Like, like I told my boys too, is the same thing. It got to the point where it's like, and like with Fortnite, you, you could to. just play another one. Especially, if you played Super Mario for four hours and then died, are you fucking but kidding Super me? Super Mario is different. The thing about the games now is, is they're all like based. Like even think about Call of Duty, you're dying nonstop. Yeah. Right? So. so who cares? Yeah. Just play again. Just I'm respond. not a good shot in those games. Like it's I can't. Hard. It Jace, took a while. Jace I can't fucking, use them both at the you same time. Jace play Call of Duty. Mm-hmm. It like, took a long time for me. And Fortnite is like Call of Duty's way too. Jace, everything is colored the same, and it's way too Jace, realistic. For, where Fortnite's like cartoony, so it's a little easier. Jace builds like a maniac, oh, bro. That. Holy fuck! What? If he's I if room. I encounter a builder, I'm just <laughs> like, oh, I'm fucking dying. Yeah. Jace, it's Drew, fun to play Jace was like four We were watching him play Grand, the- Grand Theft Auto He was doing drive-by shootings oh, yeah, bro. and shit bro, like, You see him play fuck? GTA Like he's so good at video games Even Call of Duty It's unreal Oh and Luke's good at Fortnite unreal. too But he just takes shit too NHL seriously NHL was funny When me and Jace were playing NHL together Yeah he talks a lot of shit <laughs> Cam yeah, plays a lot of COD right He sent you a text yeah, talking t- shit Give us a like, Oh I know I have his number COD is bitch. serious Come on, come on <laughs> in here Cam Get him in here Caught is serious shit, and you get yeah. mad, but, like, um, I don't know. Like, if you're playing COD, it's definitely, like, a higher pace. If you like, say right? COD. It's, like, a lot. Yeah. It's a lot. <laughs> but you can get used to it just like any other game if you keep playing, but you're Kids. right. It's, a, like, very, like. The colors are too similar for me to, like, be able to be that quick and just. Yeah. You ever see that that fucking old guy online who plays Call of Duty, the vet? Yeah, you bastard. The old guy? No, did you see the. The old sniper? There's a video I've seen of uh, an old man playing playing GTA. Grandpa or something. He's online and he's an old war vet. There's a GTA and a guy that, and there's a like, grandpa oh. playing GTA for the first time. He smacks a lady. And he's all excited. <laughs> <laughs> it's fun. It is fun doing things you're not allowed to do on GTA. <laughs> Stabs her. He's like, oh, I got a knife. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking funny. Did you ever play like a tournament for COD or anything like that? Or uh, no, I did a Just couple for Halo back in the day. Like, Halo. Really? Yeah. yeah. See, that Halo was one was like, want to know terrible at this one game. of the first old school games like that? Duke Nukem. Remember oh, yeah. Duke? Oh, Duke Nukem. On the computer, though, I yeah. remember Duke Nukem. Remember? Doom. Remember when yeah. we remember the very first computer we got? Do you remember what it was? Commodore. The Commodore sixty four. Yeah. Lo- remember we used to play first, like, system, right? Olympics on it. Isn't that like Google a video that game shit. system? Commodore. No, it's a computer. Hey, yeah. it's fucking old. And we had Winter I Olympics, know the Summer Olympics. We had Javelin. Remember yeah. the Javelin game? So that like. <laughs> Yeah, that was before video game systems. Yeah, Yeah. that was before video game systems. And like at the time, arcade arcade games were the only ones that could could have enough RAM Uh, to play a good game. Fighter Jet one. Uh, There's a bunch. Remember the floppy? Remember the ColecoVision too? I think I I still 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 have have that. You have it, or is it at mom and dad's? It's at mom and dad's. Coleco, Atari. We should bust that. I have all the Nintendos. We should bust that out. We should do a fucking content piece do where we'll go to <laughs> just and we'll get all these old like. gaming are you, consoles. Seriously. Are I'm you old. talking about this shit? Yeah, bro. Literally. There yeah. ain't no way. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, go down. Bro, bro, this, this is, is what we grew up with. This is what we grew up with, bro. Right there. That one right there. To the left. That exact, this guy? exact yes. one. Exactly. The 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 hard yeah. the drive and well, everything. Me, uh, yeah. yeah that's so that it. monitor that's so that it. monitor has the RCAs in the front and the back. We use that as a gaming monitor for years and years after. That's insane. Yeah. Wild bro. So what year Commodore, did it come out? It came out in Is Commodore yeah. the brand or is yeah, that like a cam, isn't that engine? fucked up? Yeah, it's it fucked. is fucked up. <laughs> when were you born? Eighty five. Eighty five? 
You so, don't you don't realize how quickly like things went from that to fucking. What else I tell we? my kids like all the time. I was like, you guys have no idea, no, bro. Like no, I was no, like, no. I was born oh, where there was and even, no internet, like, no you, cell phones. You born, Cam? We're 92. full speed now. Like, we've been in everything. Like yeah. it's fucking. Yeah, You're 92. Seen, you an old. You a little bitch. So like you didn't. You didn't really <laughs> start like. Old, then I'm like, wait, I'm seven years older than him. Yeah, so if you were it. born in '92, like you're eight when the 2000s happened. So you still don't even aren't taking things and, in. And like, I grew you up have with memories, the doll, but... dollar a day when you when Dell was like, oh, for a dollar a day you could own our computer, so, and they had all the commercials so. and shit. Like, dude, and then my mom's like, Dell. oh, I'll buy one for a dollar a day. Yeah. So seven dollars a week, whatever. Yeah. yeah. And she bought it. Fuck trying to think that. what was, that's how what I got was my first computer. We in 2000, I remember like the Millennium thing. I remember watching MTV at Donovan Den Hartos. That was just when Tony Hawk did the 900. That's was, the name. I was smoking hey, dope. I need a bear. I was getting high as fuck. <laughs> you want? And then the one day Tim he man got it. a sheet metal cock. Tastes like dirt. <laughs> Tastes like dirt. Does it? I don't know. Yeah, it's because we just smoked yeah, the honey good. pot. Yeah, I know. That's the hey, problem. And then, uh, and then the one day uh, yeah. he was like joking around with his mom and he was like, Mom, make us a pie. She made us an apple pie. Like We were like, what? What, what was the name again? Don- Donovan Den Hartza. Yeah, Den Hartza. Remember Donnie? So yeah. they moved up to uh, was Beach. <laughs> I, I honestly I haven't seen him. In- Muskoka. Well, sorry, yeah, sorry, Muskoka. I don't know why I said was Sega Beach, but yeah, he's got he just got married recently. It's beautiful up there. His mom and dad are up there still. His dad moved up there for work. Wow. And they just moved out of there. Jody, which is my parents' friend, Jody yeah, lives in their she house. She lives in the house. Jody. It's trippy because I go to the house and it's like I've been in this house. I grew up Break in that house. down. Song idea, Jody. No, it's stupid. Don't ever play that song again. <laughs> Charlie's stupid. Songs about girls' names always rock. Charlie. Hey, what else was what there? Was that, one? What were we even just talking about? No, we shit, totally that, shit we had when computers. we were growing up. Who's oh, yeah, computers. No, I want to write it. What about a CD Walkman? <laughs> okay, you, you so okay, yeah, it? so so yeah, so I had, a, I still have a Panasonic tape. Cassette Walkman Shockwave. Those things are worth a lot of money. Man, actually, I actually fucking think Look I that did up, Cam. If it's not wrecked, you could have got like they're oh, like eight hundred. So the Discman, the the Sony ones, like the ones yeah. that are locked, the white ones and shit, the mm-hmm. Walkmans, the CD players they're, are yeah, going for yeah. like nine hundred dollars right ones, now. The Shockwave ones. What's that? The Sony. The uh, Sony Shockwave. Sony it was Shockwave. the first like portable Discman that didn't like skip if you fucking ran or yeah, you know, because they all would skip. Yeah. With yeah, the shaking. Yeah, I, Bro, had, I, had, wow. I had the cassette. I had the yellow one. I had the CD player. That's that classic, bro. So go up. That's the cassette. So I had a camo yeah. one of those. So and go, I just recently sold to like a, a collector guy. Go back guy. cam. I need Sorry, to get buddy. something where I can. That one's fire. 49 bucks though. Like, I think I only That's got it. Oh, you have to just click the top tab. That that opened a different tab. But the yeah. CD so player. So see the CD player? No, I'm right good there. on that player. one. That one's killing me. I had me. that shit. You know what? I'm about 90%. That motherfucker's in a box upstairs somewhere, I bet you. That is the reason they made Jenko jeans also. Jenko jeans, yeah. Because everyone had those, but yeah. they they couldn't fit in their pockets. Yeah. So they made them fucking giant jeans yeah. with the giant pockets. They were so big. I remember yeah. when I was at school, when I was in high school, there was a dude that had Jenko jeans with pockets so big, he had a laptop in them, bitches. Yeah. Oh, I seen a video today that was like when you roll up at a party in the 90s and the guy pulls a fucking two liter of Mountain Dew. Yeah. Uh, For real. porn like cassette tape, yeah. bunch been, of shit. I started. <laughs> I was listening to corn recently. They're, they're so good. <laughs> you sick, are gay. You want <laughs> y'all want a single <laughs> sleep? <laughs> I'm trying to think what else there was. What about food wise? Like what was back it? in the days? Like <laughs> remember that orbit water with the oh, fucking yeah, the orbit. Remember, uh, remember Jolt. The Jolt, Jolt Cola, cola. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, that was yeah. like the original energy drink. I feel like yeah, that's well, still in the states. Jolt, yeah, or like the original fucking uh, seltzer or or cooler was Mike's Hard Man. Yeah, yeah Mike's Hard the Lemonade. OG of yeah. Bro, yeah. fuck, that was fucking. That kind of came out then, right? Yeah. And it tasted like shit at that. Oh, time. Oh, I mean, I didn't. I w- I just remember going to like softball tournaments yeah. as a kid and like you know it's remember remember when like you could go and spend like two dollars or a dollar and get like you could pick all the like the five cent candies oh, and stuff my grandfather fill a whole bag and it was like two dollars for candy now it's like two dollars for like four yeah yeah my $2 grandfather owned for a variety store skittles. so we would go there constantly Rhonda yeah. and dina used to take us when yeah. we were kids all yeah. the time and fucking penny candies yeah. take us to yeah. the stop and go what was i it actually that? remember what was the stop and go before the stop and go 
It was a stop and go for no, a long time. It has time. been for a long time, but it was something before that. Do you know, Winx? Do you know the name? Was or it you Winx? Fucking was with it no. uh, Max? No. Nope. Was it a Max? No, that Max was, Milk? Nope. No, that, that was where the subway it, it, was. And yeah. that was so a Becker's. Now. That was a Becker's. Becker's. Yeah. Becker's, yeah. yeah. But before stop and go, it was something else. I forget what it was called. Because everyone was like, they hated the name when it changed. I remember when we were younger. I forget what it was called. I do remember everyone called it Stop and Steal. Yeah, stop. <laughs> the, grab, the grab and dash. I also remember that's the remember first place I ever bought no. Pokemon cards, and they were fucking Scott bootleg Pokemon like cards. Charleston Chews, man, right by the register. You like say something, they'd look up. Yeah, they had all the, they had all the best bo- bootleg Pokemon. Shit, like, Pokemon and he's like, you know? got one in his hand. He's pointing. He's got it in his hand. And he's like, he's pointing, like tapping it into his sleeve. Slides shit. right down his sleeve. <laughs> that was the day before there was any technology to say you were stealing. Scott, but was fucking... Just like kids. We were kids at that time. You know what I mean? Well, it's yeah, just funny. You know, <laughs> no crimes were committed. Sorry. Maybe maybe minor crimes. Maybe, maybe minor like crimes. <laughs> but I definitely remember now. stealing some lighters and shit. <laughs> Oh, yeah. And I remember getting caught being like, hey, I stole, and then, you know, you just give it back thing, and then the, run away. The thing I stole the most of as a kid was my dad's weed. <laughs> True. Fuck. Shh. No, nah, fuck that. They, nah. it's whatever. They yeah. know. It's they whatever. Know. It's whatever. It's whatever. <laughs> oh, I stole my dad's weed. And the the when it got easy to, lead, to get caught was when my younger sister started smoking a little bit because I would steal a couple roaches from my dad's stash. And she would, and too. And then she would, too. And he'd be like, man, I fucking ain't got no roaches here, man. And as a kid, you think, like, he ain't gonna notice. But now, like, as an adult that's a stoner, like, I know exactly where all my <laughs> shit is. I know exactly where all my shit is. Yeah, I don't. I don't. My kid could fucking <clears throat> steal them all. Oh, my God. My kid could fucking roll a joint down. I would never even My know. kid could yeah, light and yeah. smoke a joint, and he'd be beside me, and I wouldn't even be like, <laughs> hey, bro. <laughs> yes, relentless. No, I just I mean, no. I wouldn't do that. I would punch like, him in the face, honestly. Uh, yes, I would be I'd yeah. punch him in the head. My kids know, don't touch me. I give him a fucking. <laughs> yeah. The old fucking. RKO out of nowhere. The old Yo, lick what? my booty hole. Clip clap goes the cheeks. Hey, did you guys see that ladies um, pro like hockey league there? Did I haven't see, watched like, a second of it. Okay. I've watched they're a allowed of it. to like They're allowed to like hit a little bit and shit. There's been like a couple like nice scrums or like yeah. borderline Has there been fights. an actual fight? It's getting close. Yeah. It's getting closer and close. It's going to happen at some point. But so. What I want to ask you guys is, do you guys, would, would you kind of allow them to fight like the NHL? Yeah, why wouldn't you? But well, they have but they have bird cages on, right? Yeah, I was they just, just going to say, the first thing they need to can, do is get rid of all these bird cages. Because I don't think the girls all want to wear them. No, they should be wearing half visors. Yeah, yeah. Just That's like, what they want like to the kind of, like, they want to get to that, I think. E- equality, man. I don't know. Which, Sarah Nurse said something that she would rather wear the full... Yeah, but page. that's okay if you could choose to do it. You, you should and be able I to guess, choose. Like you don't have to, you don't have to change the way things are. But I've always felt that. You got way, the studs out the, there with, the with no visors on, ready to duke yeah. it out. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking big old bull so like, what you trying Calling to say? Tam- <laughs> Hey Tammy, get out there and take care of that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Tammy goes out there. So yeah, there. like dudes are pretty too. We're going. They put their faces on the line. <laughs> if you want to be a pro league, well, it's, right? Throw in. I mean, they, how much do they make? It, I only, I actually wondered if there was hitting in Cam. it. I'm like, oh, yeah, it looks full, like it's full contact. Kind of, is yeah. it full uh, contact? Yeah. WHL salaries. You know what else I don't like? I don't like that they all have the same logo. The jerseys are ugly. They look like the, the Sunnyvale jerseys. The jerseys are all terrible. I think they all change. are exactly the same. Like, every team has that. Sa- it's the I, league's I logo. Think, it's not I the I think they're just logo. doing that because it's just starting. And now well, they're seeing. Now the they're starting at. to, like, sell out arenas and shit. Oh, yeah. So now I can see them naming teams. Yeah. Um, no, I would like them see, them see them do <laughs> so, more. There you go. So between 35 and 80, right? So. And they re- they receive a raise annually. That ain't but, enough to live. But the thing is, though, right. is you got to think is they're probably all their travel and everything's free. endorsements. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, you don't pay. But it, for 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 two it, quarters but, of the but year, you got to remember it's the first season, right? That's the thing. That's, they, yeah, if you're getting eighty G's, and, and, and for the your... thing is too is like the WNBA is funded by the NBA. That's not funded, is it, by the NHL? Uh, no, I want to say it's owned by like the a rich corporation in the, Toronto. Because the NBA, yeah, the NBA is. has it funds the WNBA. Yeah. But I don't know. I'd like to see them do more with like get some individualism in the teams, like not just Minnesota, you know, not just New York. Eventually, they should just have it like play for like NHL teams, have them in the same cities. Yeah. Heck yeah. Play in the same arenas. Do the fucking. 
Yeah. If they want to wear half ca- half visors, do it. You know, no bucket warm ups. Yeah, because so it's not like it's... owners, right? Yeah, Canadian Tire, yeah, right? Yeah, Canadian, Canadian tire. tire. Yeah, so they're just a bunch of big corporate like, sponsors. Yeah. To me, that's, that's, that's like a house, like, that's what a house league does. I think like, Molson's everyone, in on it now, the too. Tim Hortons. Yeah. Everyone's the Tim the Hortons, Tim right? Or the yeah, right? Or they're Gary's Wood. Like, even even uh, Luke's team, they fucking all chose the, like, each team chose their name. It was like the Orange Crushers, the Red Devils, the this, that. It wasn't just Red Team, you know? That's Stone what Cold ETs. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I kind of feel that is. It's like, oh, Minnesota versus New York. You know, Toronto versus. Yeah. So apparently Toronto. next year they're supposed to have new jerseys and, like, actual yeah. names yeah. and logos and yeah. shit. But yeah, hopefully. Like, you think well, it's it, good they did. My thing is, is bros, I haven't watched a second because it's, I don't know. It's not bad hockey. If, if, if Man, they, if they went but they're full hitting in. Is it, who's that one girl? Uh, she's fucking. That one girl? What's her name? Yeah, that's what I thought. I want to say Sarah Palin, but it ain't. Sarah, Palin. It's close. Sarah Nurse. No, Sarah she's, Palin. She, she's, she was like the first draft. Oh, she first Take draft. Sarah oh, Palin yeah. playing hockey. I'm just joking. The I first. She, she was the first overall pick in yeah, the draft. Yeah, yeah. She's fucking yeah. good. No, I know play. the girls are good. I just yeah. haven't watched it because that's no. It's whatever. yeah. She likes it. And that's it the up. thing. Uh, getting getting more hockey fans that are actually hockey fans to watch it. Um, you, you need do? a little more individualism it, with the teams. Yeah, I want to see cool take jerseys it serious, with cool logos. Bro. Like, make it look yeah, fucking, yeah, yeah. not just fucking the yeah. jerseys you found at a garage sale. Yeah, they do look like. Uh, what name did you say? He has no idea. Yeah, I couldn't. <laughs> they're, they're, yeah, I don't know. I'm fucking. Yeah. I'm, <laughs> I'm infused, bro. Hey, good job, right. Cam. You spelt first overall draft pick, right? <laughs> he, he's Google. Yeah, that probably <laughs> corrected his shit. Don't even. Plymouth. <laughs> Yeah, we Blimey. we chirp cam constantly. No, triple H T R I P P. Triple triple H like trippy red. <laughs> I almost put three P's, but I'm like, is that no, why he they spells say triple H triple, like you know? triple and then A E? No, it's triple H as in Hunter Hearst Helmsley. You know, three H's, triple the letters. Hunter Hearst Helmsley. But I thought it was like triple boy. Triple H. Cause he like, like you know, water out, yeah. You know? Oh, I get oh, it. I like that joke. Don't ever say that again. <laughs> I like it. Who Never. doesn't like good jokes? <laughs> it's not a good joke. I'm working was, on my did dad you, joke. You didn't. It was you, dog shit. Didn't you say something? Oh, about yeah, I'm just joking. Good. I love you. Did you say something about a John Cena movie? Oh yeah, I just watched this. So I listened to the podcast Chris Chris Van Fleet. Chris, Chris Van, Van Fleet. Fleet. Yeah. Good podcast, by the way. Shout out, maybe. You know what? Anyways, he did a thing with John Cena, and they were talking about his newest movie. Yeah. It's called Ricky Stanicky. It's on Prime Video. So I went. I was like, Oh, I got nothing to do tonight. I'll go home, smoke some joints, and fucking watch this movie. It's like <laughs> co- raunchy comedy. So when they, it's a it's a group of buddies that um they got in trouble when they were younger, or they were about to get in trouble when they were younger. So they framed a made up friend named ricky stanicky they like wrote it on a, a jacket or whatever and left it there right so and they got away with it so their whole lives they've been getting away with this lie of blaming ricky stanicky anyways fast forward they go they're on one of these ricky stanicky fake trips and they're in the atlantic city and they meet this random fucking drunk kind of guy who is john cena and he he <laughs> let me just he he plays a guy named Rock Hard Rob, who who sings at a strip club, but he does like parodies of real songs. So it's like, ooh, baby, I masturbate. Oh yeah, I seen those songs. Everyone yeah. is about jacking yeah. off, and the other was like, uh, it's a nice day to jizz again. <laughs> so it's fucking hilarious watching fuck. Cena do this, right? Yeah. So they go back home and they almost get fucked over. So. And he, he turns out to be an actor. And they're like, so let's hire this guy to be Ricky Stanicky. And that's kind of the rest of the movie. And it's fucking really funny. It's one of those old, like, kind of Adam Sandler style movies. Yeah. And hey. yeah, I never, see, you don't see John Cena in that, like, you don't leading kind of role. You don't like see that. John yeah, Cena. Yeah, you don't even ever. see him in the movie. He's just, no, but, he's uh, pretty funny. And he just did, like, a, the thing at the Oscars, Oscars where yeah. he came out fucking yeah. naked. Everyone's like, it's a ritual. Yeah. yeah it's so funny. <laughs> Where is he? I, I didn't see him. I just seen like nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah funny. Whatever. Good, good for him. But yeah, so watch it. It's 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 a good laugh after some some joints. Chris Van Vliet's a good podcast. 
Yeah, I really like it. Yeah. I've been listening to a lot of his so, shit. Yeah. So what's your favorite movies that have a wrestler? Um, yeah, fuck. I already know mine. Spot. What? Walking Tall at the Rock. Walking oh. Tall is bomb. Ooh. It's funny because Rock is such a bad. What's bad What's the one with uh, um, the Expendables is good too. Yeah, Stump the Old Expendables. And, that one kind of like it, it was all right, but I don't think they're starring uh, roles. or see no evil. Kane. See no evil. Kane. Or Marine. The so Marine, know. I always really like. Walking which Tall apparently is. Apparently, Stone Cold yeah. was supposed to get that one. Walking Everybody tall is forgets about that notch. one. Well, what's the one with Sean William Scott? Fucking. Uh, the Rundown. Remember that one? Where he goes oh. into the jungle yeah. and fucking. Stifler? It's Stif- Everyone knows him as Stifler, yeah. but he has to, like, bring Stifler back. That one's really. That and Walking Tall came out at yeah, the same Walking time. Walking Tall is a great movie. I, the Condemned with Stone Cold. Yeah. It's a great action movie. Yeah, it's good. And I can watch, honestly, any time. I watch it at least once a year. And there's those old ones growing up. Like, I remember watching Suburban Commando with Hogan. Oh, yeah. And the Mr. Nanny. Yeah. And yeah. shit like that. Yeah. Good little things. Like, I don't know. I'm trying to think. The best that. ever. Stone Cold was in Longest Yard. Too, yeah, yeah, Longest yeah. Yard I really remember. I think he shit himself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he actually uh, says fucking the N-word. In yeah, the, you know, that was yeah, crazy. Yeah. Yeah. That Nelly's face. To Nelly, yeah. 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 No, was, and Stone Cold talks a lot about that shit on his podcast. It's funny because I, I just see videos of him on, on, on his Instagram now, and he's literally, like, shoveling shit with oh, a cat on his back. I was going to say, I meant to say, when you're talking about Cena... His uh, he was on Logan Paul's thing, and he was talking about there's his like uh, his Instagram or his Twitter. I think it was his Instagram or whatever, or Twitter. But he's like, it was just a picture of traffic, and he's like, what what's the meaning behind? That? He's like, I was stuck in traffic, <laughs> and it's just like the funniest shit, just like the most random things. It's like, yeah, why did you take a picture of this? I just liked it. Like well, tra- just it's, literally traffic. Why did you take that picture of like what does that mean? Like I was just it's really I was stuck in traffic. To his, uh, <laughs> like what do you mean? Like. His Chris Van Fleet podcast, it's really humbling listening to how he talks about how much he learned about even even some of the things that go over good in the crowd. He learned from what mistakes he made and yeah. that video of the guy who's like following him yeah, that and, he, video, yeah. and he's really polite to him. Yeah. He still says, I feel like I could have handled it a little bit differently mm-hmm. to make it, you know, um, or like when he was that guy, you know, it's like you you talk about getting into the fucking the spotlight. Y- your goal is to get to the spotlight, and once you're there, your goal is to keep the spotlight. Yeah. And and you know, that any day you could you could wake up and be told, hey, mm-hmm. you know, it's this guy's turn now, mm-hmm. right? So, yeah. and and looking back, he just seemed, he, he, you know, now that he's older, he can kind of go back and just have fun wrestling. And uh, not be the guy with all that pressure and shit. Yeah. And hearing him talk about that, it's it's it's, it's pretty cool, He's man. Old. You hear about how cool of a guy John Cena is, but then when you actually listen to him talking for an hour yeah. and a half, you're like, yeah, you know, this is the type of guy I would be if I was a celebrity in in a sense, or if you had this type of power. The the make a wish shit that yeah. he does, and, and he talks about almost going heel. Yeah, and not doing them. Yeah. But the reason he didn't was because like, well, I can't go and be nice to people. I can't go and do these make a wishes yeah. as a heel like yeah. that that's not your character yeah. anymore and he was like well fuck that i don't want to do that yeah shit. that's definitely that's yeah. i remember i listened to all that too it's a good yeah one. it is good it's chris van fleet chris van fleet good old canadian boy is he i didn't yeah. know that yeah, he's from toronto no shit yeah that's cool yeah hello everybody Hello, everybody. <laughs> hey, but you fucking like that fucking pen, though. Eh? That thing's nice. So I wanted to say, yes, these little uh, pen things Crit- are nice. Dick Blueberry is what it's so, called. It's, it's the Snoop Dogg brand. You can get it at Tony's Joint. They're like 44 bucks. Yeah, which ain't it's bad. It's a gram. If it's lasting you like two weeks, yeah, two weeks. that's the type of thing that would cut down a lot on my just flower smoking. Two weeks. If I have you one know, of them things, going to jobs, a gram, like dope. That shit lasts me four days at work. I mean- <laughs> See, yeah, we're like when it's in your pocket constantly. Yes, it's easy to just hit it all the time. But I'm used to just a little bit here and there in between Want jobs. So it's like I had one f- that my darling sister got me oh, for Christmas. Come on, oh, catches like he always does. Yeah, except for that one. I'm like, it's dick shaped. I'm surprised it didn't go in your mouth. <laughs> it already oh. has twice. <laughs> <laughs> Too small. She's an angel. I said, I just said, she's an angel. Saint from the heavens. 
She was raising your ass. Yeah, yeah. So I've actually been rocking a pipe to cut down <laughs> on my fucking uh, weed smoking. What kind of crack? Pipe? Like during work? <laughs> no, just like instead of smoking like three, just four. Just for the listeners, you work, need to be more specific. You said a just, weed pipe. I picked up a pipe. A classic like, weed pipe. A classic crystal meth pipe. Yeah, what, the ones no, that you no, no, no. steal from Stop and Go, and they're <laughs> pretty much the ones that come with the screens. Yeah, yeah. You, you're burning right. one of them. Mainly because the ones that get hot, they burn your lips yeah, and like, shit. I'm just trying to you're cut down on the fucking, actual. Why don't you just take one pipe? of those fucking Fuck cans off, there when like, you leave? You're smoking a metal pipe. Yeah. What are you fucking ten? It's hey Drew, do you need a bong? It no, it's not, I actually like it ain't even about that. It's about like yeah. I can smoke. I smoke a lot <laughs> less during the day when I can just get a little bit. You ever smoke out of a pop can? Yeah. Like at work recently? Yeah, no, no, no. Oh, Fuck off. <laughs> this is rather than rolling three joints, I can use one joint's worth of weed and smoke three. You want to know one of the biggest stoner things I ever seen was when we were younger. The old like cigarette foil. Remember I don't get how Chrysler you, money, how you fucking, used to like do the lighter thing or whatever, paper. and then you'd peel it, and then you could roll joints. Oh yeah, the I definitely paper. use yeah. the rice paper for. <laughs> and I've the used rice the paper. He even knows from the, name the rice paper to make to smoke out of a pop pop can before when you don't have like a screen or something, right? You use well, the tin foil to, and poke a couple holes. You don't even need to do people. that. All right. What? You don't even need to do. No, that. you don't really need to. But when you did it, we sometimes would do it out of the top part. Kids, oh, I have a big old chunk of man, I made bongs with less before. Except man, give me stuff a stuff that I gave you. A pop can and an avocado and my snorkel. Remember that stuff that I gave you? Mike gave me a big old chunk of hash. So I fucking saved up. <laughs> you don't know where a guy can score a chunk of hash, <laughs> do you? Hey, <laughs> I, I fucking saved up for. I mean, it was probably like a year and a half, just keef of every Duncan kind of weed I smoked, and it was all just mixed. I had it was like a hundred and ten grams of keef, something crazy. It was like fucking a thing like this. It I chopped so, my weed. I never used so, my weed in a buster. It was so I much hash. It with scissors. So we had a friend with a it press keeps and the we taste. pressed it all. Oh, fuck, man. It keeps the flavor. Nobody got time for that shit. It was oh, awesome. God. All I heard was, I'm lazy, Ain't baby. Nobody, I'm not lazy. I'm a lazy baby. I'm not lazy because I do roll drugs. You're Chuck the Freak. You're lazy, baby. I'm not Chuck yeah. the Freak, You're fucking bro. lazy, baby, bro. Oh. You look like you him. If you lazy, grow your beard bro. a little longer, you're him. Fucking same I'm hair. Sorry, the guy is stealing my. He's look, gorgeous. Okay? I'm just saying. I'm sorry. He's a gorgeous motherfucker. I ain't lazy. I'm fucking the most active motherfucker here. I'll tell you that. Want to bet? I would. I would bet. I walk. I, would six, go down I walk six k a day just at work. A day. What am I? Work right shit. Just at work. Hold That's on. not active. What do you mean? I'm walking. You're walking. I walk well, too a lot at work. He's talking shit to me. It is at, um, I'm at, what am I at? Hold on, sorry. Hold on, my, my shit fucked up. I'm at, what is that, 6.2325K right now. That's daily. That's nothing. Congratulations. <laughs> so don't say you're more active than me. Beach. I don't fucking wear a watch that tells me how active I am. Why not? Let me tell you. Every <laughs> Charlie, day, ding, 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 ding. Yeah. I'll, I'll, no, no, no. <laughs> active I'll, shit. Yeah, Heart's exploding. exploding. Just going out playing hockey with my kid every single yeah. fucking day. Playing actual hockey. Two games. Yeah. Sunday. Yeah. Um, Love you. We tell yeah. this Sunday. And I do a lot of active. <laughs> my job's pretty active, too. Hey. I also want to. I'll see you like, this Sunday. Uh, when I get to work, I actually don't stand there and do my job. I, I don't know. stand there either. I can't stand there. <laughs> Fucking! I want to get in on your side here, Charlie. Back up and down the line to do my job. I threw a fucking um, one of those Fitbits on or whatever because my mom's like super active, walks a lot for her job and shit. And like, she literally uh, was like twenty k steps a day or whatever the fuck. So she was doing like about six, seven, eight. No, twenty k steps is like probably like. 10k at least 10k yeah so she's like getting those numbers because she's like walking to work and everything. my like, old my mom's super active rib not right? job so she's like let's see if you could beat it cameron and then i literally just put one on and i'm a cnc machinist i get the best of both worlds where i walk around a lot but also sit on my ass a lot right because <laughs> like i use a crane i don't really have to do too much right i just walk around and do whatever Sometimes I got to use my muscles, maybe minimal, but I ended Cock up muscle. doing that and then going skateboarding after, and I got 32K, and I was like, I could still, like, hang out, carry on throughout the day, but when I looked at my watch at, like, 
eight thirty or nine o'clock. It was like fucking thirty two k. Yeah. So you're, you're like, so why you're was there fourteen thousand between six thirty and seven a.m. when you're looking on his watch? <laughs> That's not. He's, uh, pull, uh, he's track, pulling his goalie. Some watches track drive. All that. Seven ten. Huh? Some watches will track drive. Like oh. I had a I had a, a watch that tracked my drive. All of a sudden, I got to work and I'd like yeah. I had, I'd walk ten k. I was sitting there. Luke's yeah. you know Luke's mom was like, "Oh, I did this," and like we we were driving, and she's like, "It's going up right now." <laughs> what the yeah. fuck? Because it's GPS located, yeah. right? Yeah. So you got to use like Bluetooth, and then it just I don't know, it yeah, works. mine's all through yeah. through Bluetooth. But uh, I just know how motherfucking active I am. What's this? And I would put that to the test. But what, no, what did you have there? No. <laughs> You're way better at that. Yeah. Trust the me. The barbecue you make me thing. Come way faster. Or is it just I'm not better at that? Who knows? Anyways, from dicks, <laughs> dicks to a fucking barbecue. He's a fag. What's this? Shit with shit? Jake or whatever. Barbecue with Jake. Oh yeah, Cam's got right some videos. Here. You know, we talked about our boy barbecue with Jake. Hello, everybody. But I didn't know he was like a, a big, big, big boy. Big boy he used to be a big you boy. Watch tell. this video. Oh. And it's like afterwards, you kind of get, you understand. His voice is even different. Who's that guy? The mustard binder. Mustard binder. You know what the problem is? Is eating steaks that big? But he he's he's I know clearly he's, still doing yeah. what he was doing, yeah. and he's a lot thinner, which yeah. would be probably the hardest thing. Yeah. The funny thing they talk about on on this clip right here is his age, because yeah. no one knows how old he They're is. They're like, we it's can't so tell if he's tell. eleven he or he's forty. He looks young. Like to me, he looks young. You can't tell if he's Maybe, eleven uh, or forty. Ideas about doing any different food series this year, or anything like that, on your. I think so. this is the right clip. I've been thinking on that. I could be answer. totally fucking wrong. I did a little poll the other day about something. Like, how old do you think Charlie, he looks Hey, there? Charlie did a poll, too. <laughs> Charlie's was a lot deeper in depth. I did do a poll with the fans. Like, who's the best? And they picked me. Yeah, because it was on your page and you were the only option. My page? I voted for you. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> I'm done with that. Turn that shit off. It's, a, it's not the right clip, but they talk about everyone Must, tries to guess his yeah, age. Yeah, Mustard Bond. No one really knows. He's 67. He's oh my god. 14. He talks like he's 67. How do y'all? He looks like he's 14. How do y'all? We got to get it all incorporated. I'm guessing like. he's like my age. 37. You're older. You're an old motherfucker. You guys are older than me. Fuck you, babies. Cam. Fire away. Cam's question. Cam's question? Cam's question. Turn your mic on, Gabo. It's already on. <laughs> it's up, right? Fuck, already on it. <laughs> this this sure is, is going to be the epi that fucking cancels sure. up. All right, all right. This cherry blossom it tastes pretty good. Yeah, I bet. So, I'm trying to, like, I thought of this mm. on the way up. As I was fucking cherry driving flavored. here, I had my playlist on shuffle. Oh, okay. I was going to say, you, as I'm driving here, I'm like, tell me you found something to research on the way of driving here. <laughs> the well, I did. No, no, no. Okay, your playlist. Go ahead. My playlist. And it was a song that I hadn't heard in forever, but then me and my wife watches rom-com. It's called, like, Anyone Else But You or some shit like that. And it was great. Like, all of a sudden, like, in the rom-com, had this, like, super gay song, but I'm like... I know it. It's like staring at the blank page before yeah. you open, you know, mm. unwritten. Yeah. The, word, yeah. Yeah. the rest and I is out. Wasn't it like a commercial song? Yeah. Feel yeah, the yeah, rain yeah. in your skin. <laughs> no one else can get it <laughs> you. Only you can let it in. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I'm like, and I'm just jamming out. Is that Kelly Clarkson? Man, if I was like with my boys, I'd be like, I'd be hesitant to like just bust that out, right? But like, everybody's got that song, though. Dude, everybody's got that song where they're like, I don't give a fuck if anybody's around. I'm gonna jam out to it. So is that so are Kelly, you gonna is that ask Kelly us, Clarkson? No, yeah. it's, so are I, you gonna ask I'm what song sure. it is that we don't? <laughs> no, so do you have a song, song that like you listen to? 
behind closed doors. Behind closed doors. But I would listen, like, but if I heard it, I would jam jam to her because I hear it at weddings. See, for me, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, but I mean, like, a song that you, a different song that you would, like, feel embarrassed that. Like, there's nothing I, your don't buddy really, knows. I don't really get embarrassed. Not even embarrassed. Well, we're just like, we have just no fucking that you're shame. No, but like I don't get embarrassed about it, like, like yeah. music and shit. We don't like have that. no like, fucking shame. Yeah, I, I don't, don't care what I like. <laughs> I fucking okay, listen Okay, but to... what's that song that you would like that you jam out to that nobody thinks that you Dude, would? Dude, constantly, I'm telling you, constantly, daily, I'm in the work truck fucking jamming out singing <laughs> and i'm like think look to bo- next to me and i'm just like man this guy must think i'm a fucking weirdo all the time or, or, you know what i mean but it can what's be that any one song, song any fucking song like but what's one song that like as far as embarrassment or something no, just something that you my like, windows are up i'm all tatted in? up you look over at me yeah. and i'm like the hate is gonna hate hate, hate <laughs> yes hate. that's what i'm but talking about gonna... oh. <laughs> mine's probably uh <laughs> probably like a, a mary up. j blige <laughs> probably like Family Affairs, I like that one. It's got a nice beat oh, to yeah, it. Oh yeah, that's good. Nice. I like it's that like, one. It's got a nice I, I, beat I'll, to it. So. I literally will jam out to anything from from Come this on. to that. So much in between. I could go from West Side Connections to the Frozen Town. Oh show. yeah, yeah. I'm down. Hundred percent, hundred percent. You guys can all fucking, come with me uh, on a fucking road trip for sure. <laughs> far Behind by Candlebox. If you're in, so, so, let me find me. And uncle, and uh, uncle, like, I'll be in my car, fucking acting like I'm uncle on Uncle Charlie's gonna babysit when he wakes the kids up. And too. then personally looking at me like, what the fuck? I, oh my no, I got it. There, I was working. I left the place. I turned left on the Dougal, and I fucking had my tailgate down. I didn't know this at the time. I had my tailgate down, and my ladder was on the tailgate. Fucking it idiot. fell off. I'm fucking pulled up to the thing, far behind it by candle candle boxes on. I'm fucking didn't mean to treat you all so bad. Someone's a guy at next you to me like is that. trying to get my attention. <laughs> Finally, he does, and he's like, "Dude, I think you lost your ladder back there." And I was just like, "Oh my fucking god!" <laughs> what a dumbass. <laughs> Dude, the ladder was not there when I went back, yeah, and it I... was a sum of five minutes. I'm telling you, <laughs> I was rocking out in my car. You know, bro, I just fucking... smoked probably th- uh, the last half of a joint that was in. There. Bro, I remember I had a fucking panic attack. I had my fucking. I turned the corner, same thing, just all ripped up. Not paying attention, my hockey bag fucking oh. flew out of my. I didn't have a tunnel cover. <laughs> on my tunnel cover was off at that pl- at that time. Turn the corner, give me that shit. I turn the corner, my left. fucking. I get I get home. I go to pull my hockey Any bag out of the back. Infuser? Go to pull my hockey bag think? out and fucking. Get, my hockey bag's gone. I'm like, oh my god. I go back up. I'm go back up. It's on Dominion, like by your house. Some kid sitting there on the side of the road, just sitting with my hockey bag waiting. That's not, was that what, yeah, with me? I left your house, yeah. It was took, my fault? We, we went to hockey. Yeah, but then it was this kid was waiting on the side. Was it the my fault? Bag. Yeah, it was your fault. God damn. Why didn't I close it? Why didn't I close your tailgate? The, I forget what happened. Because you're a jabroni? It wasn't my truck, maybe. That was the... No, it was my truck. I know, but like... But you I'm grabbed saying, your like, sticks and you... I forget what you did, but you yeah. left my tailgate open and my tailgate... Yeah, because usually it's like you put something in and you fucking... Shock. Close the tailgate. Yeah. Nope. Oh, now you now you give me the lighter. I didn't know. Good thing there was an audience. He for watches you, me for you thirty were seconds. You're looking for your dick or a lighter because you're like, like where is it? Good thing for an honest kid that gave me my hockey bag back. Oh, yeah, no, I honestly that was. We literally got to the place early and we were smoking a fatty. Trocker. We had tons of time. By the time we realized his equipment was gone, oh, yeah, there was right. ten minutes before we oh, yeah. played. That's right. I fucking. <laughs> we How did we even find out that it was there? I called Steph. Yeah, uh, yeah. Steph went looking for it and found it. Yeah, and she ended up coming and meeting oh us. Oh my god! Lucky she wasn't fucking. Yeah, some loopy. kid on the side of the road with it. That's so funny. I forgot that we were sitting there chilling, smoking weed, vibing out before our game Bro, in the morning. We go, go to the to back go, and I'm go like, go to the back dude, of the truck. Tailgate's, tailgate's open. open. Only my hockey sticks are there. Yeah, I'm like. His tailgate was open because his. We drove all the way up the expressway. He had them la- one of those lazy bags with wheels on it. <laughs> So, so it, it just literally zoo. It luckily fell out like right by his. Mine house. was still there because I have a real man's yeah. hockey bag. Shut Mine up. has yeah. wheels on it, but I still carry it. Yeah, mine's just zooped right out. Zoopity doo. 
Fucking guy. Hockey. Like a poop. What a day that was. <laughs> Fucking. When are you going to play in our league? Never. Come on. Come play. Fuck that league. I'm not driving out there, bro. Come, we we can do no. crispy Hardboard, rice, man. spicy tuna. No, thanks. I'm cool. You want this infused? Get infused with me. Get infused to the league with us, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not coming to that fucking league. <laughs> I might play sailors, Sailor Whalers once a month or whatever. That's about it. Okay. You'll be sucking wind out there. It's a faster skate there than it is it fucking. It is way crazier. It's like Jordan Howell and Deslip and all them and soccer <laughs> and fucking. Somebody. You know, you can't out there. Watch me. I went, and played, uh, I went and played after our it's Sunday. It's not that desolate. It's the other they, one, uh, Kyle. My Kyle, old yeah. team that I used to play with, the Dirty Birds, shout out. Um, they were like, oh, we got a couple guys on vacation. And we've been trying to link up where I could play with them, but it usually overlaps our stuff. It's no dumpsters. Man, I go out and it's their semifinals, and it's fucking quick fucking hockey. And it's those rinks seem twice as big as Harrow's rink because – from the from the top of the circle to the blue line in Harrow is maybe eight feet. In a real rink, it's about fifteen, twelve. Uh, you know, the 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 offensive zone is so much bigger. That's why I'm so glad it's like we play diff- in Harrow. So no, it's, and so it's it makes like, my speed that much faster. It's like the difference but when you get on a bigger you know. rink, it's like your speed is that less of a factor because it's so much more ice. Charlie and I are playing each other this week. <laughs> Cough a little louder into that microphone. Yeah. <laughs> you should cough directly <laughs> into oh, the man. microphone. I'm <laughs> trying to move it. He hey. moved it. I'm and clean moved with it. I'm clean. <laughs> with it. I'm, clean okay? I'm clean. Okay. Yeah. I'm clean. I'm clean. I'm clean. Famous last words. What a guy, though. But yeah, it, it was fucking fast hockey. So there was a, there was a little bit of a scrum. Two guys went at it. A buddy mm. of mine. Two dudes went they at go, it. They go they go to the penalty box and they're talking shit, right? And Can the I guy in our our team it calls calls buddy a fag fag. Oh. And the scorekeeper kicks him out of the game. <laughs> really? Yeah. The scorekeeper hit the buzzer as play is going on and says, "No, no, this guy, he's out. He's out. You can't use that word, blah blah blah." Because oh he's like, "Oh, you God. fucking buddy, I'll fucking get you, fucking it. <laughs> and yeah. And I was like, I have never seen a scorekeeper kick who, someone who, out of the game. Is a scorekeeper someone I know? No, 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 no. It was, it was. It oh, was, oh, years ago. Okay, sorry. No, no, it was oh. on Sunday, but oh. it was in Windsor at the ice park. Oh, okay. So it's a guy who's hired by the league. Okay. Who the league has probably clearly. Was it an older guy? No, no, no. <laughs> I'm just curious. Sorry. No, obviously it wasn't. It was an employee boy. of the league, so the league's <laughs> rules, and clearly because in 2024, you know in 2024, yeah. something like that. Yes, yeah. I, I understand mean, why you kicked I him out of the meant, game. He mean, said he said a derogatory statement, and in these day and age, everyone's soft, and you got You don't want to yeah. get sued, and this and that. So my thing was the only question I asked was if he is soft. Age. It's and it's a podcast. You're supposed it to ask soft. questions. Okay? It's fucking soft. soft. Cause it, soft. people have been calling people faggots in hockey since fucking <laughs> every started. Since bro, hockey I'm started. Sure my I thing is though is if the person was hockey. old that was working the clock, it might have slid. That's not one that I use though. No. I'd rather no, talk shit about really how I, I shit you are in hockey. And there was one like in Harrow, we got we got young kids kind of doing our score and this and that. And no, no, none of them would ever be like, "Oh, this guy said this, you got to kick him out." But there like, was oh, one time where oh, I was okay. saying "fuck" a couple times, and the ref was like, "Hey, come on, man! Like, fuck, we got to." I only like a went to the. Girl right there. I, I only I only shit. went to the box two times this year. Yeah. You're a fucking yeah. a goon loser. Fucking loser. How, how many times have you went to the box? So you're a fuck. You're I you're that. while you're you while your dad's more. leading the league in PIM, so <laughs> shocker, eh? That's part, Bones of spot, kidding, huh? that's part of the old poppies. I, I I tell him, stay the fuck away but from no, me. No, I've Bones. only had a few. And most of mine were like, I don't yeah, want to like, fucking want to kill you. <laughs> but no, your dad like he doesn't I'll tell like you, he doesn't fuck with me year. on the ice. Thank God. Mm-hmm. No, I know, but I mean, no, thank God. Never would fuck with no, me. I know, but I mean, thank God. My dad's like me, and only would really fuck with someone who who does something first, kind of. Yeah, you know, your dad's still that, that way, scrappy too, like, style of player. I don't go out there with that on my mind. 
Like, I'm going to whack you if you're in front of me in the net or this or that. But the second you do that to me, then I'm like, okay. I'm going to slash the shit out of you on Sunday. Yeah. <laughs> just, yeah. <laughs> no, I don't hack and whack you. What time do you guys play on you Sunday got, and where? Because then, then you <laughs> guys time? can do it to me. It doesn't matter. 155, we start. 155? Gabe not, comes out to not, all the games. Not, Shout out Gabe. It's not important. It isn't important. It ain't I know, that but great. I kind of want to go watch it. Oh, <laughs> you, you, you don't want to watch it. It's too washed up. Luke bumps. will be out there. Too washed up bumps. Yeah. Washed but yeah, up. I'm probably I, playing I the best Drew hockey to, I've ever played in my life. I bugged Drew to play was, every I'm saying year. I was shit before. I bugged Drew to play all the time. Oh, yeah. And, you know, I want CJ to probably play, hopefully. I bet. Best way to get in is through the spare list. Yeah. Yeah. It's a little late now. No, but for next season. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I know a guy. I actually <laughs> was going to say he could spare for fucking Thursdays, too. Willie's hurt for the rest of the year. Of course he is. Fucking big bird. He went to, he had to go to a clinic, and they were like, you probably shouldn't be working. Well, because he fell off be that thing? I think so. What is, at, so was at, at hockey on Sunday, he was complaining about his shoulder, and then fucking Woody, Woody kind of ass over t killed him, and he's like, man, I landed right on my and fucking he shoulder. fucking he busted his shoulder up playing baseball, tripping over first base, bro. Yeah. He literally <laughs> was running to first base and went to step on a bag. They're saying he just weird plant, too, and he it was literally his collarbone flew, yeah. almost landed in the grass. He yeah. flew like fifteen feet in the air and landed and broke his collarbone. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You, you know how people Shoulder, you put your arm out, you you break your collarbone, right? Bro, it's a big skate. It's hey, a big snowboarding hey, injury. Charlie, you should call him. He was like, Willie, he didn't, call him. Didn't bother. Why? He, didn't bother. he doesn't fucking answer. We've called him twenty yeah, times. He, he's no, no, fuck that. Do fuck we? Him. Should Willie, we try? Fuck you, Willie. Fuck you. No, hold on, Charlie. Oh, hold on, hold on. No. I got, I got something. I got something. Make sure answer. you set your phone like he's on the mic. Not gonna answer. He's a pussy. He's not gonna answer. I got something. Yeah, let's see how many episodes it takes for oh, Willie to answer a I phone call. I got his call. name three times here, and it's all red, non-answer. Yeah, he doesn't answer the phone ever. I, I thought I. There it is. There it is. Thrilly. It's thrilly. He's, that's the problem. He's not gonna. I'm answer. fucking. There it is. What call time is it? Time to call you. What a fucking bum. <laughs> told your call has been told you, no faith. The person you're trying no, to reach. No, just leave it. Told you. Fuck you, Willie. Willie, fuck you. Willie. You're a bum. I hate you. <laughs> Again. No, I'm good. He Again, was, Willie. Good. Again. Called him like 26 times. He hasn't fucking answered the phone. He calls back, though. This so is why everybody gets a sticker but Willie. I still wait of, for mine. Chris has to give me one. They're awesome. <laughs> Mine's like center of my helmet. It's funny because a couple of guys from our team got got wind of it last week, and they put it in the team Chris, chat. Like, Chris what is has this? stickers. They were like, "What is this?" And I was like, "Oh, blah 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 blah." And they were like, "What?" what? Say, we want one. <laughs> we we want the whole league to fucking have it on their helmet, but the rule is, is Willie can't have one. So yeah. <laughs> So everybody has to fucking wear one. Fuck you, Willie. Yeah, fuck you, Willie. This is why you don't get yeah. a sticker. Because you can't even answer the phone. So what? So his shoulder, like, he's fucked, eh? <laughs> Here, <laughs> he Willie. Told, Willie, we're going to have a segment on you he now. He was told that he shouldn't play. He He's probably going to play the last uh, game of the year. I'm going to rock him. Oh, yeah, you just <laughs> <shut> him. <laughs> <laughs> now, now I'm going to be scared to go near him. Nice slap shot, too, Willie, by the way. So just Took so a you clapper. Know. Bro, he scored on the softest slap shot ever. It was, <laughs> it was literally a flubber. It was a if flubber I, shot. If I was out there, Willie, he, I he tell passed, I, okay. He got past the blue line they and kind of did one it. of these whackers. I've, and it, I've said and to fucking like Willie, I've told our guy who plays net, I ain't blocking shit, but I told Willie, I will block your shot. <laughs> I, will, I won't block anybody else's. <laughs> I'll block yours, though. Willie's like, why mine? I'm like, because you shoot muffins. Yeah, he is. He <laughs> is. So Willie, like, <laughs> hit me with a shot one day. I was, like, looking for it. Someone else hits me with it. I'm like, fuck. 
That's too funny. Oh, it's so, but that he's fucking, goal, but he but... scored a lot of goals this year, yeah, man. I'll give him that. Um, but he just shoots in the right spots. Yeah. So, but he like, but anyways, he comes we... across the blue line. Our teams are battling it's back two, and forth. It's ding, 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 back yeah, and forth, yeah, back yeah. and forth, back and forth. Good game. We're up six, five with 30 seconds left. Willie comes across the thing, does his like knuckle puck. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Fucking wind up, shot it like 26 miles an hour <laughs> and it fucking knuckled it, wait, in it, it knuckled right? in dun, 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 dun. the puck wasn't even flat it was like no. almost turning i was like oh my yeah. god yeah. <laughs> the, so but fuck you willie that was a slap shot yeah yeah but uh it was funny though i asked the ref i'm like why isn't that a, like isn't that a slap shot well it wasn't hard but i'm like but yeah, it was still a slap yeah. shot like yeah. okay so i'm gonna go down there and i'm gonna rip one but i'm gonna yeah. get called because i'm gonna shoot it hard mm-hmm. so that was yeah, the only thing that had me like one of those like, rules that's like they do you're... let a lot of things go yeah because i have seen a few of them they feel bad for him that's the that's the line well, i've seen a few guys that's the line like, rule what they want to get rid of is those huge fucking <laughs> wind-ups over your head and blast and shit the you maurice richard i mean the lionel, the lionel. yeah the only yeah. guy to get a and pin. lionel's done a couple Pins this on year, a penalty but, shot know, where did where, he uh <laughs> you yeah. didn't he didn't where we were talking okay. about it in you the got a penalty room. on a on a you, you got, got a penalty on a penalty shot okay let's go give me that <laughs> i need to consume that well, story. okay so he was at it was i think it was his first year so he didn't know the fucking slap shot rule <laughs> oh he didn't oh, he yeah, told so, me this. Lionel so told yeah me this. so lionel likes to tee up right so he fucking <laughs> he got a fucking penalty shot so he went in on his penalty shot and he teed up did yeah. they, did he score? I think he did, yeah. But the ref's like, nice shot, but now you have to go to the penalty box, and the goal doesn't yeah, count. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> Actually, me and him yeah. laugh about it. But he's like, yeah, scored on a beautiful shot. He just, you're not allowed to take slap shots against so. against blue. I drew two penalties in one play. Cause Brad fucking <laughs> interfered with me, and then I got on the. Bre- I still got away and got on the breakaway, and then I got tripped. And he ended up calling two penalties at one time. And I looked at the refs and I was like, damn, that's a first. <laughs> so we went on the oh. five on three in Did one you play. Score? I, d- I had to come off because it was the end of my shift. I was fucking oh. dying. Oh, I don't want one of those on. Is there any? And uh, no. we Fuck. ended up. It's all right. Okay, don't worry about I, it. It's I don't fine. think we ended up scoring. I don't, we'll be done like, soon. We were doing a bunch of bullshit out there. It was like one of those, like I said, we played you guys and we played good. And then against Blue, we just, it was like we could, couldn't get anything going. Nobody's <laughs> making a good pass. Nobody's skating, this That's and that. Crazy. And and it, it was just one of those things. It's like, holy fuck, guys, what's going on? Like beer league. Yeah, yeah. So, But still, fuck you, Willie. Yep. Yeah, so we I- are knocked out of contention. The Red Devils, and uh, maybe we'll win that case of beer on the last. I think everybody's getting them. Yeah, cool. cool. A case of beer. Yeah. Last you know, week we'll slide. Hey guys, in hope room. you guys like it was Lucky tough. Lager. Like you know, I wasn't prepared Ants to. Getting to Corona, run a they're getting lucky. And... We're getting MGDs. They're getting. <laughs> the guys are getting yucky. <laughs> you, I wasn't you guys are getting to lucky that I'm gonna team and and throw in the you know, sauna for a little bit. Who does what and. Because it was like, yeah, we get this five on three early. And then a couple of people are looking at me being like, okay, let's put a line. And then a couple other people are like, no. And it's like, well, do you guys want to fucking win? You guys, want to, <laughs> you know, what do you want to do? Because I, I don't really care that much, but I don't want people to be pissed at me for what the, the choice I make. So it's like, yeah, if I if I was going to say if we were on a five on three, it's like me, my dad and Kevin out and yeah. let's go. But. No, I just said, let's just keep going. Aaron like, and someone else on And defense. we ended up doing nothing, and it's like, well, fuck, you know, what can I do? Like, you're damned if you do, you're damned if you don't. You know what I, I'm saying? I, I said to our whole room, we had, like, a full squad one day, and I looked around. That was, like, one of the first playoff games. I said, "Are we? do you, do you guys want to win? Yeah, or are we, are we? Are we going for the kill, or yeah. are we playing? Yeah. And I looked around yeah. the room, and everybody's like, yeah. we're playing for oh, wins. So I'm like, you, all right. You can't tell Lionel to sit. <clears throat> You can't, you know. Lionel, you should Cobb be sitting every fucking <laughs> shit. You should be a bench dog. Yeah. So, so they yeah. they can't breathe no more. Like, you know, Your ass my gets pops there. looking at me. He's like, "Hey, we should do this," and I was like, "I I know that, but I like to win." You know, I also Lionel, don't know your role, to piss off, So <laughs> you know, it could help if Ty could save a fucking goddamn biscuit every <laughs> once in a while. 
He always seems to stop Anthony on the breakaway. Yeah. Not always, though. But. I pissed him off, though, yeah. uh, at the end of that last nah. game, though. Lionel? No, it was, the whole team. It was one of those I, I games, like, off. we were we were kind of shutting you guys down. I and fucking, you guys were... I wasn't... I was feeling shitty. Yeah. It was, I was sick. Yeah. I was fucking... Yeah. And but the puck kind of squirted out right at the end of the game. It was like just inside of our end. Whistle blew. Whistle blew, and the the end of the... I shot it fucking right down on that. Not really. Like he didn't. It wasn't a... slap it. Or no, anything. but it was right along the ice. But yeah. it was like it was moving. Yeah. It's yeah. like I'm not the type of the guy would be like, oh, you did this. Surprised, oh. you, surprised you didn't go cross check him in the head. The puck yeah. never left the ice. Like no, it never I mean, left like, the who ice. Who the fuck cares? I made sure it never left the ice. Yeah, but even so, it's like unwritten dumb rules. Who cares? Oops. Like <laughs> I would do it to, like not that I would do it too in a sense. If like, I come oh, in that league, I'm just gonna turn and clap it into the bench, your bench. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And <laughs> Willie like Willie was with you and he's like, Oh, I just I'm like, what are you what are you thinking? Blah blah blah. And it's just kinda like Sometimes you're not thinking when you're playing hockey. Really came over you're just playing hockey. Oh right? no, Ty come all the way down the ice, the goalie. We exchanged. Oh yeah. We yeah, exchanged. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We yeah. didn't exchange fucking mm-hmm. high. How, yeah. how how are oh, you yeah. that time? It's like you're gonna get sour about that. Like, come on, who the, like? I don't know. Well, I probably shouldn't have done it, but whatever. No, no, no. It's and a playoffs. I, I, like, it's a playoffs. I agree that standpoint too. It's a, it's <laughs> almost the same thing as the clapper on an empty netter in yeah. a sense. It's like. Respect the game. This and the that, game was over really at like, that point. Who the fuck cares? Come on, so why like, is we're he playing care? hockey. I don't know, but you should have punched that goal. I in shot. Uh, I shot it right on. Right Ty, on that. Ty gets gets frustrated. Yeah. Uh, but I shot it right on. You're real frustrated when you get beat was up. Was it like right on that? I honestly didn't really see it. I, I think, didn't see it. I think some of the guys said it was like I right didn't see on it. that. I saw and I saw Willie kind of going to your face, going up to you, and I was like, "What the heck?" I'd fight Willie. He must have did something. Cause they, I'm gonna it, fight him for not answering. Like that wouldn't happen. Pussy. Like if it was somebody else, <laughs> all he said to me is, "Willie's just like he's just like, oh fuck." He's like, "Ty's gonna be pissed." And I looked up, and here yeah, comes Ty. Yeah. I'm like, "Oh, all right." Yeah. I didn't know. Like, are we exchanging words, or are we both sitting five games? Like, I didn't know what yeah, was happening no, at that no. point. I know Ty like, wouldn't it, it fight. Shouldn't like, we're not gonna fight. Like, but we exchanged poison like, oh, Fuck the whistle blew, and you shot it. You know what I mean? That's no, kind of like how I think I it was it. the end of the game. It was the final no, it was, buzzer. It was, no, uh, it was the final buzzer. No, no, it was to go to the break. No, it wasn't. Yeah, it was, man. I I'm pretty sure. No, it was right at the end of the game. Was it? Yes. I don't think that matters even more. To me, it's like you should be happy. You know, be yeah, happy. I shot it. It, it was probably like a second or two like, after. Yes. Yes. So it was probably like a happy. second or two like, after yeah, the buzzer. Fucking, fucking jabroni. Yeah, it's. It's all you guys are a bunch of washed up. And that's bumps. really like. So. I punched that goalie right in the head. I love playing. <laughs> Bow. I Fuck love you. playing in that league, and I love like the camaraderie. What I don't like is like the com- the competitive, like when it's like, oh shit, we gotta win this to do pl- it's automatic know? five it's like, games though. You know, well the, worth like it. It, it kind of turns me off a, bit, year, a little bit because I don't like <laughs> being competitive and winning and. That like I do, I'm a competitive guy in a sense, but I like winning shit. It's, it's funner to go out there and just have some fun and and yeah, yeah, exactly. And that's what I've kind of been about. Whatever, do my shit. <laughs> Maybe it's because my team sucks. But <laughs> no, it's you know I I wanna I would like them guys to look back at that year and say we had fun. Or whatever. That's why I didn't. As long as the beer's cold, this who line shit? out when we went to play the, you are you know, the five are you, on three. Are you the guy running the team? I was never supposed to be, but the guy running the team left the team. Who's that? <laughs> Brush. Yeah, Jamie. Jamie. Brush. Jamie yeah, I Jamie's off this year. So, though. No, so it was kind of like. Now I guess I'm here. I'm running the team. <laughs> you dirt. Every, everyone wants you to fucking. Everyone, it's like it's it's the same as like running a novice team. Yeah, Everyone wants you to put them in, yeah, and you're true. like, God damn! I don't. I you wonder. Know, if I just mic- want to come here and play <laughs> hockey. That's all I want to do. And do you guys I hate think the mics fucking... picked that up? You're a dirtbag. Well, I heard it. <laughs> it. Sounded like a smiley. <laughs> Cam just over there. Okay, all right. I'm, I'm yeah. all on so that. We got, we got um, WrestleMania coming up though, oh. right? Yeah, who cares? Are we about to cut it? Uh, re- no, it's uh, April sixth. 
So we still got another ep- We still got another okay. one episode before. There's some, there's some interesting matches. Coming, we'll let like, some shit sink in. Brock yeah. Lesnar is coming. There's back. a ladder yeah. match. They just announced a ladder match. Yeah. What yeah. is it? Tag team ladder yeah. match. Sixteen or something. Like that. Nah. Nah. You think so? <laughs> what about the Dudleys? Uh, nah. The Dudleys. The Dudleys. The Steiners. Nah. They like too old. <laughs> It'd be Steiners. like. <laughs> they, uh, yeah, I don't know. Not what about the used. Rock and Sock? No. The rock and Sock connection. <laughs> it's not going to be like old dudes. It's going to be like. No, no. An NXT guy, know. right? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> It'll be all NXT guys. It'll be a bunch of jabronis. Brock Lesnar. So Drew back. McIntyre's uh, Rock and Seth Rollins. Rollins, 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 Rollins. <laughs> What? Seth Ro- Rollings. 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 Like Rollings? a baseball glove. Rollings. Kevin's Rollings. Owens. What is the right one? Kevin's See, now o- I just don't Kevin's know. Owens. Kevin's it's Owens. Kef- Kevin the Kef- Owens. It's Kev. Oh, whoa. Kev. Seth Rollins. We're getting off the fucking rails here. You got rails? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was waiting for Straight that. Straight that up. You guys, All right. Wait, you guys got some rails? <laughs> you guys, hey. Did you guys, oh, did you guys say Real. rails? Anyways, okay. So are we all? Let's get the fuck. I I don't know. We're out of here, everybody. Until next week, we're out. See us. Yeah, like guy. Apparently, we gotta leave. Stay sweet. That's so gay. (laughs) Peace, bitch.